and started to get Right, so I've done part A, haven't I? So I've got acceleration, got tension. So I could do the space, really. So when the car and trailer are moving at 15 metres per second, the tow rope breaks. If the driving force on the car and the resistances remain unchanged, find the distance moved by the car in the first four seconds. So it's the car in the first four seconds. So you imagine you're in that car and the rate the rope breaks. What's going to happen? The trailer's going to slow down, but initially the car's going to accelerate. So we have an issue here because the acceleration, hang on, I'm going to give myself a bit more room. The acceleration has changed. So for part V, so the rope breaks, and the acceleration changes. So now I've got my car, which weighed a thousand G. So let me remove that. It moved as I was putting the thousand G in. All that. It's got the same driving force, which is eight hundred, but it has no. Oh my God! What are you doing? <laughs> I think this is telling me that I should stop. Really, uh, it's got the resistive forces. Has it got resistive forces? Yep, of one fifty, but I haven't got the tension anymore. I've got air, I want to work out what the A is. So if I look at F equals MA, so the force in the direction of travel is the 800. The force opposing is just the 150, and that's equal to, it was 150, wasn't it, the weight? I oh, know 1,000 is, I'll just missed out a zero. Well, that is 1,000 lots of A. So I've got 650 divided by 1,000. So my new acceleration is 0 0.65 meters per second squared for the acceleration. So let me make that look like a thousand G and not a hundred G. There. So you imagine once that tow rope breaks, it just speeds up until you go oh! and then put your foot on the brake. So I want to find out the distance moved in the first four seconds. So I'm onto my SUVA. Now initially it was at rest. Oh no, it wasn't. This is when it breaks, wasn't it? So it breaks, so where is it? There. So it breaks at 15. So U is 15. V not fussed about. Acceleration is 0 0.65. And T is the first four seconds. So one without V is S equals U. You don't you use S equals U T plus a half A T squared. So much. So S is 15 lots of 4 plus a half lots of 0 0.65 times 4 squared gives me an S value of 65.2 metres. That's right. I'm only on 3 minutes 20. I've done that question. So the important bit, if I want the acceleration, treat it as a whole particle. If I'm looking for tension in the tow bar, whatever it is, then treat it as separate. Right, I'm going to stop the video.